Hey everyone, in this video I will show you step by step how to change your logo size or adjust it accordingly for your Shopify store. So it's, I will show you pretty much how to do it, it's very easy and I will show you actually two ways of doing it because sometimes the first way may not work for everybody or, or may not work uh, the way that they want for some reason. So I will show you actually two methods on how to do it. So first let me actually just show you if you click on online store and we just go ahead and customize it i will show you um the logo and how to actually change it the first way of doing it so the first thing you obviously need to go ahead and click on the header uh right here and then you will find this option edit your logo and theme settings now uh, obviously i'm using the don uh theme but it works the same way for any other theme it's, an, it's pretty much the same. It's not going to be any different uh, for, for any theme. So we can just go ahead and click on theme settings. Uh, and here you should find your logo. And if you don't have, uh, you didn't upload one yet, you can just go ahead and select image and upload one right here. But we're not talking about how to upload it. We will talk about how to actually adjust the size. Now you should find uh, underneath the logo here, we should find desktop logo width where we can actually just adjust the size by doing that. And you can see now it's very small. Uh, minimum is going to be 50 and we can just go up to, I think 300, yeah, 300 is the max. And you can see how big the logo can get. Uh, so this is the first method. And if, if for some reason uh, this method doesn't work for you, let me just uh, take it back to 100 so remember now it's 100 pixels. So let's say we can just keep it at this. By the way, for the first method, after you're done here, you will need to go ahead and click on save, otherwise it's not going to change. Uh, and now remember, it's going to be 100 pixels for my logo. Now let's actually change it the other way around and I will show you that it actually changed. Uh, uh, so we can just exit out of here. So if for some reason this didn't work for you, or you can you can just find the option. Uh, this second method should help you out, and it should work. So what do you go? Uh, you go ahead and click on your online store again, and go to your themes. Uh, from your themes, you will need to go ahead and click on uh, the three dots besides the customize button, and then from here you will need to go ahead and click on edit code. And trust me, it's not going to be something difficult. Relax, it's very simple. You just click on edit code. From edit code, you should find yourself in this dashboard. From this dashboard, sorry about that. From this dashboard, you will need to go ahead and on the left side, you go ahead and scroll down until you see the folder that is uh, for config. Under config, you will need to click on the down arrow. Uh, and you should find two options, the settings uh, data JSON and the settings schema JSON. We all need to go to settings data JSON. From the settings data JSON, you should find uh, this right here, the logo width. For the logo width, we will find the amount that we have for the size of the logo that we have. Uh, and by the way, if, if uh, for some reason your theme doesn't show your logo within the first few lines, you can just simply um, hold control F and you can just type in logo and it, it should, you know, show you where that is. And you will need to just locate logo width. And then from here, you will just go ahead and actually change the number. Like you right now see that my logo width is 100. We can just go ahead and delete that, make it one, or let's just make it 200 for fun. Why not? So now logo width. 200 and make sure you don't really change anything else we don't want to ruin the code here and we just go ahead and click on save right on the top right and we should be good to go you just exit out of here and we can just uh, simply go ahead and click on customize again just so i can show you that it actually changed uh, and you can see now that it is actually bigger and let me just actually confirm it, go to the theme settings, and you can see now it's uh, 200 pixels instead of the previous 100 uh, pixels. So those are the two methods where you can simply change the 
logo size or adjust it accordingly and i hope uh that you liked this video and it was helpful and thanks for watching